After a long season of travelling up and down the continent, the moment is near. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined by Stuart Robson, as always, on these special occasions for commentary. We're getting close to kickoff time in the UEFA Europa Conference League final. It's Milan, and they face Mallorca. Well, Derek, we've got two very good teams here. Both like to play on the front foot. Both have some great individuals. This should be a really entertaining game. I'm looking forward to this one. And Milan's lineup looks like this. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. being closely marked but the header nothing to write home about Calabria Sandro Tonali oh great vision Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. But he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. Cardona looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game oh a goal he's equalised was he made from moments like this on an occasion like this well here it is again and what a perfect cross into the box this is just inviting someone to attack it and then what a great finish as well Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Kessier. No chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Kessier. Diaz. Can they forge ahead? And cleared away. Kessier. Real chance. And diving to thwart him.
They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Lago Junior. Costa. Cuts it back. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Could cross it in here. An attack full of promise. Plays it back. And a squandered opportunity there. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.